The poems of Sylvia Plath often explore the male-female relationship with depth and complexity. Through her works, she examines themes of love, desire, power dynamics, and the struggles faced within intimate relationships. Let's discuss the male-female relationship in the context of the poem's morning song, words, the rival, and crossing the water, using examples and references from each poem. 1. Morning Song In morning song, the male-female relationship is indirectly addressed through the context of motherhood. While the poem primarily explores the bond between the mother and child, the absence or presence of the father figure can be inferred. Contributing to the overall understanding of the male-female dynamic. Example, the line I am no more your mother than the cloud that distills a mirror to reflect its own slow effacement suggests a sense of distance and detachment from the absent father. This line hints at the complexities and potential disconnection within the male-female relationship. 2. Words Words dials into power dynamics within the male-female relationship, particularly concerning communication. Platt reflects on the limitations and influences of language and how it can shape and control relationships. Example, the lines they make the noise of history, of the echoes that are to come imply that words carry the weight of societal expectations and past experiences. Within the male-female relationship, Words can hold power and influence, shaping the dynamics and communication between partners. 3. The Rival The rival explores the complexities of romantic relationships and the emotions of jealousy and competition that can arise between partners. The poem dials into the dynamics of desire and the fear of being replaced or overshadowed by a perceived rival. Example the phrase I am inhabited by a cry highlights the emotional state of the speaker within the male-female relationship. It suggests a struggle for emotional dominance and the fear of losing the affection and attention of a shared lover to someone else. 4. Crossing the Water In crossing the water, the male-female relationship is symbolically represented through the imagery of water, representing change, transition, and the intricacies of human connection. The poem alludes to the longing for freedom and escape from the constraints of relationships. Example, the line Black Lake, Black Boat signifies the enigmatic and complex nature of the male-female relationship. It suggests the challenges, uncertainties, and depths encountered while navigating intimate connections. Through these poems, Platt provides a nuanced exploration of the male-female relationship. She touches upon themes such as distance, power dynamics, competition, and longing. Platt's use of vivid imagery, metaphor, and personal experiences allows readers to engage with the complexities and emotions within intimate relationships. The poems offer a profound and introspective understanding of the dynamics between men and women inviting readers to reflect on their own experiences and perceptions of the male-female relationship.